welcome back to another one of my videos. If you did not know who I am, I'm Fixan and this is the React Tank channel. My conspiracy is the Limelights are the best fandom that there ever is and was close. Period. Period. Okay, yeah, I like that conspiracy theory. Good job, good job. Kay may be using Zach for popularity and she usually gives a lot of hints and just in general makes it obvious that they're dating and Zach barely says anything so that's why I think she might be using him for clout. A lot of people have been saying that Kay has been using Zach for clout. You guys should go check out my recent videos that I did over Kay and Zach. If it was used for clout, then why would Zach and her get together, honestly? Is Jackery real? Of course Jackery is real. Hmm, Jack's GF, Daniel is single, Jonah's relationship, Corbin and Christina, or that someone is getting out of the band, I don't know, impossible. I don't think anyone is going to get out of the band because they did form the band themselves and it's way too early. They just started becoming successful and becoming a band and growing, so I think that would be a dumb choice if they did. So I personally believe that none of them will. For Jack's girlfriend, we got Gabby. Daniel is single. Hmm, do we know about that? Jonah's relationship is with Kate. Corbin and Christina are still together. But every Why Don't We song is about them and a girl. But it's like so perfect. Let's start from talk. Talk is about them talking to this girl, but she doesn't listen. But when the girl talks, they also don't listen. And they're always on their phone. After that, it's hooked. Hook is about them attached to a girl again and they're all pretty hooked on this girl. After that, eight letters. Eight letters is about this girl wanting to say eight letters I love you to them. But they say, just say it, it's not hard to say. And it's really deep. Then, big plans. Big plans is about a new year, 2019. They're thinking about the future that they want to have with this girl, but I guess this girl doesn't want to because they confessed her. And then, cold in LA. Cold in LA is about them in LA, but it's too cold, so this girl walks away and trying to leave LA, but she doesn't want to talk about it. Then, I don't belong in this club. It's about the boys going in the club, like waiting for an hour in line, but then when they're in the club, they don't feel comfortable and they want to hang out with the other girls at home, and they don't belong in this club. That is a really good conspiracy theory, actually, so I give props to that one. Are Jack and Gabby still together? Gabby? Yes, Jack and Gabby are still together. They have been seen going to concerts and hanging out. Was Kay Cook a fan before Zach dated her? There have been these rumors that Kay Cook was a fan before knowing Zach Heron. To be honest, I don't see the problem with that. If she was a fan to start with, that doesn't really make up anything because Zach would probably know for sure. And Kay did do covers of something different or like Why Don't We covers. She's really good at it, let's just say that. Well, I think why don't we are starting to swear slash cuss. <laughs> oh, tell me about it. Nice. He sat on the table. This was just so guys, bad. Guys, don't listen to Daniel. It looks fucking amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, it looks no, so it good. No, it <laughs> Look at it. No. Look it's, at it. That's ugly. That's ugly. I think that they are doing a song every month and then putting it into an album at the end of the year. Yes, that is true. They are doing a song every month. Timothy, Jonah's father actually proved that theory. I also think that if they put out another album, they're going to go on tour for that specific album either next year or the year after, just like they did with eight letters. That is totally true because that is a given. Us limelights are not here to let. We got to go to the concert and party. Here is my theory. They are hot, talented, and amazing boys. That is a really believable theory. I am mind freaking blown. Ooh, T, my conspiracy is that Zach and Jonah hate each other. In that one video, Jonah puts his arm around Jack and Zach moves it. I also think that Jonah thinks Zach is annoying because Jonah is too mature. They also don't really do cute poses together or talk much in the interview. Anyways, that's a tea. By the way, kind of sad I didn't see you at the Dallas show, but love you. I love you too. Thank you so much for sending in the conspiracy. And what you were talking about was from the Dallas golfing interview. I actually went to that. Jonah and Zach, all of them were actually really tired. Zach wasn't his goofy self because I remember, I remember meeting him. Jonah was very tired, you can tell. Well, I have to like blend in and be awesome like you guys, so. Oh, nice. Yeah. Is that weird to I, add I, I feel 
Yeah, absolutely. I'm not athletic enough. Wow. There you go. Wow. I just pulled something. Don't do that again. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. So welcome back to Dallas. We got a big show tonight. Southside, y'all ready? Yeah, man. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yes. Yeah. That Corbina isn't together anymore. I hope they are, but I'm not sure anymore. Corbina is still a thing. Don't worry about it. Christina has just been really busy with her own work because she goes to college and she has a YouTube channel to maintain. She also does not want to be known as Corbin's girlfriend, as everybody addresses her as. Cause she's known as Beauty Chicken, she wants to make her own name for herself, we love a standing woman. I think Why Don't We would be the next One Direction in the near future. You are wrong, Why Don't We is not gonna be the next One Direction in the future, they're gonna be the next Why Don't We. They may be as big as One Direction or even bigger, but they're not gonna be One Direction because they are Why Don't We. My theory is, I think that K is using Zach for clout, like you don't have to agree with me on this, but just hear me out. She makes it obvious that they're dating and Zach doesn't even really say anything and like I don't know I just feel like there's something fishy about Kay and soon once she gets a bunch of clout she's gonna go and break Zach's heart. I don't know that's just what I think. You think that Kay is using Zach for clout because she's not keeping it undercover as much as Zach but if you can't tell from Zach's comments he comments on almost every one of Kay's photos. Conspiracy theory in the 8 letters music video Corbin is surrounded by clouds meaning he's dead. Jack locked himself in a room and won't get out. Zach being the youngest is at church and can't handle his best friends being dead. Daniel committed some kind of sin which gets him trapped in some kind of dungeon, the black room with the lights. And is mad at everyone. Jonah is destined to find peace in the forest so he can find a bird and follow it to a flower which he believed would bring him peace. At the end, all five boys are together, meaning they will always love each other no matter what. Please find this useful. My mother thinks I'm taking a shower right now while I'm typing this. Oh my gosh. Girl, you gotta go take a shower. Don't lie to your mother like that. But I do like this conspiracy theory. I do believe that it's true. The meaning of the Why Don't We music video for eight letters was very heartfelt. I believe this theory as well. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this. As you notice, I am on photo booth on my laptop because this is the part where I realized that my camera ran out of battery and I had no more film left. So I guess I'm just gonna do my outro here since the tea video is done. I guess my camera was like, you know, burning up because the tea was too hot. Anyways, you guys, thank you guys so much for joining this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to leave a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button down below. Comment down below your favorite part of this video. And I will see you later. Peace out, girl. Sky. Save me. Can take it. Save me.